Oh, look at that. Fuel explosion. You can see them slipping on, on the uh, ash and, and literally having to drag each other up the street. There's an oh incredible amount of panic down here in downtown Manhattan as people are realizing... Okay, that was a Manhattan shot. Yeah, I'm glad, yeah. I'm glad to hear that. Not that uh, yeah. I wish that on Manhattan, but... Look at that I thought I was cloud. looking at uh, panicked people running on the street of Washington, D.C., which is not the case. That's the shot earlier from the uh, implosion of the North Tower of the World Trade Center. Look at the live shots, one in New York and one in Washington, both just smoldering. The plane that crashed outside of Pittsburgh in Allegheny County... Now, my understanding is they were not entirely sure, in fact, maybe doubtful that that was the hijacked plane the one that they originally about. said was headed for Washington, D.C. The one that had less than 15 minutes. The U.S. Which, Air flight. Uh, should be doing something any second. Now, I, I find it hard to believe that's not the same plane. Or I know. it's not a hijacked plane. I know. It's starting to get pretty mucked up because there's just so many things occurring now so quickly. But I don't know that it hit anything. <clears throat> I don't know either. Trudy, do you know the uh, Pittsburgh plane? Is that the same as the one headed for D.C. they were talking about? Um, they're not saying one way or the other, but they do say um, that it was a wide body, which means oh, like 300 yeah. people were well, aboard or, or could have been aboard Definitely. potentially. Um, we never did play the Bush press conference <laughs> oh, earlier this morning. Yeah. which is, He's in front of a bunch oh. of kids. He's at this... You know, I, I suppose this was, a, was this some kind of appearance for education? Yeah, probably. That's, yeah. That was After his. After all, they're, they're campaigning for their next uh, run at presidency, even though they just got in, you know. Ladies it, and gentlemen, oh, this cool. is a, a difficult moment for America. I, um, unfortunately, will be going back to Washington after my remarks. Uh, today, we've had a national tragedy. After his, so he's still going to make remarks? Is that what yeah. he's trying to say? Yeah, he, when he wraps up with the kids, he's going to have to leave. Uh, but absolutely I, You know what, I, 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 bet, I would be things. willing to bet that he did not do no, that because they had him that. in the air shortly afterward. We saw Air Force One swinging around on the taxiways and onto the runway, taking off, now that being the command center. But I can't believe he's in the air. he would even think... He was going to like. Right. Well, I got to finish my schedule, right. I, and I don't know that he did, but that's what it sounded no, I, like. I absolutely which is the first thing saying. I thought was really odd. Right, because we know that did he really finish his remarks and have a wonderful, uh, very calm departure from the elementary school? Absolutely not. But to say that, to even say on television that you're going to complete your remarks and then leave, is almost to like politely excuse yourself. Hey, sorry about this. Um, this interruption of, of our little uh, little tail here. Darn, that back here. Listen but, to the. Uh, you know, he quickly. I agree with you. The vice president, which we sort of took note of. Two airplanes have crashed into the World Trade Center in an apparent Ooh, terrorist see, attack uh, on our country. Up. I have spoken to the vice president, to the governor of New York, to the director of the FBI. Again, this is, oh, in, front he's of, wound. This, this is in front of these kids. I know, weird. I know. And I've ordered that the full the resources House. of the federal government uh, go to help the victims and their families and, the, and to conduct a full-scale investigation to hunt down and to find those folks, folks. who committed this act. Those folks. Terrorism against I don't know if our folks nation is the right word. Stand. And now if you join me in a moment of silence... May God bless the victims, their families, and America. Thank you very much. There are, that was a, lot it. Of, there are a lot of victims, too. What's new, yeah. Trudy? Pardon? What's new? Um, you charged in here like you oh, knew no. something. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, that's, thought, that's, well, okay. that's how um, every, I've never seen so many um, shocked faces in this building alone. This is a microcosm of stopped. what the country is probably feeling at this moment. But, yeah, every, you know, I remember, every place though, business has stopped. Everybody's looking at their television. we're well, prematurely and... blaming or, you know, speculating, I guess, about Osama bin Laden. But um, I remember maybe a year ago him saying something threatening air travel in the United States. Yeah. Um, not only that, but points in New York City, which they had, which um, they, always they went they through always flag New York. a period where they had it under some extra security, the the tunnels mainly. Remember and at that. that time, he was threatening it, both air traffic yeah, yeah. and yeah. Uh, well, and New York City. The, if it's him, he's put the fear of God in me. Oh well, yeah, I tell you, I'm not this guy looking forward to else. stepping so, out of a plane I mean, anytime again, soon. Again, a speculation, uh, no. and all that George Bush will say too is that a terrorist, obvious terrorist, a fact. Um, Can you believe? Attack. But the FBI investigating something that again it's oh. transpiring i don't feel terribly uh comfortable or 
Uh, what's the word? I'm not getting a great sense of security that everything is going to be all right, as we have not seen the president since what time was that? Well, 9.30. Um, since he got on board Air Force 9:30, 30, One split. But I would just have expected maybe hourly or half hourly someone from the Pentagon or the Defense Department or yeah. Vice President Cheney or someone to be on TV calming everyone down saying yeah. hey look here's the what's happening here's what we know right now. it's a little bit These nutty are, events are being are transpiring and being um you know kind of like followed by the press and the press they are, is kind yeah, of doing all the, the talking at this when it comes point. to that. Well, the press is the kicking press ass as always. The press right. is the ability to to, uh, to sure. gather information at a frightening pace and also make a few mistakes along the way. But, right. I mean, that's right. to be expected. I would think the the mayor of New York, I know he's busy but as hell too, but I would think that the mayor out. spokesperson will be. I'm just amazed that no, we haven't right. seen no, you're one right. press conference. Right. Since the first plane hit right. at what time? About nine o'clock or no? It was um, like just before nine, and yeah. the second one right. was at nine o three. They were eighteen minutes apart. Oh, were they? Mm -hmm. Oh, no kidding. Okay, I was wondering about that. We right. saw Bush yeah. in front of a few kids in Florida, yeah. and yeah, very shaky Bush. Uh, hey, do you want to pick up the phones and see uh, see what people are calling in about? Yeah, we can just talk to some people locally on the phones. Hey, Mike. Hey, how you doing? You just left Metro. Oh, yeah, it's crazy. You don't want to go anywhere near it if you can. Well, there's no need to go there because nothing's taking off anyway. Uh, I was working at the new terminal. Uh -huh. They cut us out of there. They said, everybody get out of here. This thing's got a big bullseye on it. Yeah, as of... <laughs> All right. Well, as of uh, around, I don't know what time was it, 940 or something, they just declared that no, nothing was taking off. So uh, Obviously for, for NBC. And uh, as we were going across the street, we were not terribly far from the World Trade Center building, the South Tower. As we were cutting across in, 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 a, in a, a quarantine zone, actually. Um, Ron and Sana, who, uh, who I watch a lot on CNBC sometimes in the afternoons. And, and He's been in an eraser like fight. <laughs> Well, Everything began to rain down. It was pitch black around us as the the winds were whipping through the corridors. He was uh, obviously outside the trade center when it when it imploded, and he's covered with and soot. It was, it was yeah, and they're dust, on, like uh, white dust. Was a that ash? And, and of course, we. But know he's that. made no effort to to wipe the ash off himself. Of which, course, he uh, has. I'm a little su suspect about. Oh, that. please, please, look, look, look. He came in from outside, backstage in the makeup area before he went on television. They took a bucket, like a child's plastic bucket that they play on this on the beaches with. And they well. took a little Obviously shovel and they put all that yeah. dust on his head and on his suit. Ron and Sonic could take his coat off and he'd look a lot cleaner right now. And he also yeah. could wipe the soot off his bald head yeah, exactly. and put a washcloth there. I know, because his whole, the top of his head is all white dust. It's like um, somebody blew dust all over, like rose powder all over him. I was within about a half a block of the building you know as I mean? it started to come down. Can you tell us what you saw It there? was fairly clear. Uh, there were some areas look along it. the street that did have uh, blood and just, debris. There were no longer people in the area except for a couple of uh, journalists and police officers who were uh, oh. quarantining uh, the containing the area so people wouldn't cut through. <clears throat> once, it, once it did begin to clear after that, several minutes of pitch darkness, what did you see in the oh, street? Geez, uh, it was a very deep gray smoke. It was, it was, it honestly looked like a bit of a nuclear winter, the type of thing you see in the movies with, with ash all over the ground, on top of cars, on police cars, on windows. Uh, I made my way into a building because of the one light I could see and uh, stayed there until a couple of police officers and a few of the people inside the building were able to get into it. He sort of looks like he's, he's gone kind of... Uh... He's kind of punking out with oh, yeah. blonde yeah. hair on the top yeah, of his head. I, I agree. It's yeah. actually the edge. It's, it's was, just so right. odd. Everyone else is well dressed, and then no there he is. is. <laughs> uh, I don't know what, what it was, uh, whether it was the building or, or glass from another building. Why couldn't he take his jacket? If I got to get him a new shirt. Or I something? know. Why can't he look like Condit and hold his suit coat in front of him? I tell you what, Trish wouldn't let me go on camera like that. Be like, oh, Michael. Well, you're gonna go on camera with your suit coat like that. Oh my God. He's already got people at home rolling tape for. Him. Yeah. <laughs> She'll be forever yeah. preserved with soot. Yeah, there's a... <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, Stop it! It was it's really the, the most intense and frightening. Boy, this is That's really enough. Life. Al Fellhauer from WTKA is, uh, has got a fresh report for us. Oh, okay. Al, Al's monitoring WCBS, uh, which uh, is not a bad place to monitor. What are you finding out, Al? Well, actually, now we're monitoring Fox 5 out of D.C. But uh, Oh, you're on the satellite. Yeah, WCBS uh, in New York was reporting that the United Airlines flight, and I don't have the number. Okay. I want to say 93. Oh, okay. That, yeah, it is 93. You're talking about the, the recent crash? Shot down. It was shot down over uh, 80 miles southeast of Pittsburgh. How do they know it was headed for Camp David? I, I have no idea. I, I don't know that they have Why blow idea. up a cottage, a summer place? You know? That was just a CBS station report out of New York City. Okay. I have not seen their it anywhere words, else. Their words shot down? Shot down. Oh. That's huh. what they're saying. That was the flight from Newark, New Jersey, and it was headed for San Francisco. Uh, anything else, Al? 
Uh, not really, except that now it's coming on to almost 9 o'clock on the West Coast, and people will be getting to office buildings. But everything, according to LA TV, all, uh, all downtown offices have been evacuated, and mm. they, they've pretty much closed down Los Angeles now. Oh, yeah. well, that would, that. that would make sense. That would make sense. You would want that, yeah. Yeah. I can okay, Al, can you uh, can you keep that. monitoring? Give us a holler back. Oh yeah, I have nothing to do. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's, he's he's pretty free for a guy that has six McDonald's franchises. <laughs> it's seven, but that's okay. Seven. Hey, Al, well, 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 hey, well, hey, well, Al. Well, well, Mark told us that he was getting the other one, so we assumed there were six. So. He El pulled a Melrose Place no. hang up. Look Look at people, that. Now, what are those people oh. running out of? Is that is that no, footage from the, earlier? The, the, yeah, oh. This, oh my God! That's oh, earlier so footage, and they're running from the dust cloud, just like when Guy Gordon. Remember when uh, he oh, the Hudson's Bay? Oh, you can see when they were You can see the shockwave. You can actually see this guy's look, looks like he's in a hurricane. Remember when him and the Purton kid were just engulfed in dust when the Hudson building went down? It's like snow. Yeah, and now it's, it's like they're in fog. It's like they're in pure white zero zero fog, but it's of course wow. dust, and they're breathing. Yeah, they're all literally that. walking through uh, snow. Yeah, and Which trying to so breathe that. Uh, they're they're very wise, some of them, to put their hand or something in front of their mouth. Did you notice what I noticed a second ago? By the way, it's one of those like smell almost feces in the room. <laughs> no. oh. It's one of those Mike Clarkian observations. <laughs> oh, gotcha. oh, about somebody's hot. Okay. No, I didn't notice. It's just someone that was running at a very big. She rack. had some nice cans, I, and I couldn't help myself. I didn't want well, to notice it, but I couldn't help it. Because you're a boob man, you know. Because you love there, cans. Ba, 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 ba. Oh, there. Mark, you didn't have to tee it up and make it. me feel Where worse. Is it? Right, Where there. Is it? right there. Right there. Just the, the black chick. Gigantus. The rack. black chick. <laughs> yeah. Oh, hey, you little brown sugar, eh, baby? Oh, get out of here. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's just that it entered my yeah, mind, and, little, I, and I was jungle fever, so, eh, baby. Oh, come on, yeah, out. baby. Right in the middle of this, the, all this right event. My girlfriend's it's my time, girl... time for you to get jungle fever. Right in the middle of, <laughs> right in the middle of this. My, my girlfriend's in the hotline. Cut it out. <laughs> she's listening. She's listening on hold. <laughs> What a fine time for you to get horny. It's right on course, too. Her jugs are almost as big as the rest of her. Oh, oh get out of here. Oh, oh, well, well, yeah. A fine time to have your dick go roaring up you know, out of control. I tell you how ashamed of myself I am, and I end up taking a beating anyway. <laughs> well, the last time I saw a pair of jugs that big, two hillbillies were blowing on them. All right. Oh Cut it out. Stop. 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 Well, I'll tell you, it goes Stop to show it. you the Stop male it. mind, man. No matter what you got going, all of a sudden, Well, man. you're watching people running through this soot, and it's like, you know, you don't want to notice something like that. And I was, like, personally God. shamed. Boy, but now, now things, I obviously man. should have kept it to myself. Jeez.